This message is for Gen X. Boy, I bet this is gonna be good. And the millennials. You probably have to wait a minute. They're a little bit slower. They're, they'll be here. We don't know what you have planned for us. What we have planned for you. Doesn't really take a lot of planning. You know, you're thinking way too much about this. And why you're recruiting everyone. First off, it's not really recruiting. It's they are choosing to be on our side because they don't want to be against us. Let us know. We're letting you know. All right, would you like to try that again? You know, multiple takes is fine. That this will not go unpunished. <laughs> is this supposed to be intimidating? Oh, I'm sorry. No good deed goes unpunished, says Gen Z. I'm not a real smart man, but I think that saying has been around a lot longer than you have. And yeah, we're fucking pissed at Eminem. Okay, do you honestly think that Eminem gives two shits about what you think? Because he doesn't. The new song he made is not fucking cool. I kind of like it myself. I don't know what you got against it. Oh, yeah, now I do. Consider him. Hey, wait for it. Wait for it. Three. Cancel. I like the way you had to go one, two, three, so y'all could do it together. Go team. You thought you could get away so easily? Well, look where I am. Just look outside that window. I, I see you sitting in your parents' driveway. Yeah, uh, yep. You're sitting in your parents' driveway in the car that they bought you because you whined and cried until you got it. You'll notice two things. The only thing I see is two wannabes. That's all I see. <sighs> Millennials, Gen Xers, you can get all the people you want. You can't take down Gen Z. Holy crap, miniature whoopee can speak. I was beginning to wonder, but she speaks. You can't take down our power. What power are you speaking of? The ability to whine nonstop 24 hours or the ability to sleep for 24 hours straight? Which power are we talking about? <laughs> look at us. That's part of the problem. You want everybody to look at you like you're something special because you've been told that you are, but you're really not. Technology, you couldn't even do. Right, we want to start on technology here. That might not go well for y'all. You can't mess with this Gen X. And oh, I assure you, we can, and we most likely will, since you want to put this kind of stuff out there. Thank Ever heard of a... <laughs> Ever Once again, showing your ignorance. You would not have cell phones without Gen X. You, ne you need to do some research about what all we created that made the world better. Because when you say shit like that, it just makes you look uneducated. That's what I'm using to record this video. And I'm sure that your mom and daddy paid for that iPhone that you're recording this video with. I see all the TikToks. I see you rallying together. <laughs> rallying? If you think that's rallying, you have no idea what a real rally is. Little do you know, Gen Z has been under the ground for 10 plus years. Yep. Under the ground for 10 plus years. I kind of think you were trying to say something different. Oh shit, this makes my head hurt. Just 10 plus years under the ground. Yeah. I heard you the first time, you didn't need to repeat yourself. 10 years underground. And yeah, we also learned how to ride bike as well. <laughs> We've also learned to ride bikes. <laughs> I can see it now. You riding along on your little door, the Explorer bicycle, matching helmet, elbow pads, knee pad, training wheels with mom running beside you. You thought you were a big girl, didn't you? We've learned to ride many things. <laughs> yeah, I'm not touching that when you ride whatever the hell you want to. Leave me out of it. I know you millennials and Gen Xers don't believe that. Oh, I believe it. I just don't want to know about it. But look at us. We'll take you down. Once again, if you're trying to be intimidating, you have to believe what you're saying. And when you sit there going, hee <laughs> hee hee hee, you're not scaring anybody. Eminem is fucking canceled. Well, good luck with that. I don't think he really cares what you do. But, you know, you can keep trying to cancel them if you want to. I really don't give a fuck.